Welcome back to Talk of the Town. We are talking about a very fun event that is coming up right around the corner. And who better to do that than Mark Severson, who joins us from Zora Shrine Circus. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you. Glad to have you today. We appreciate the opportunity. Absolutely. Well, this is a fun topic. Great for families and folks of all varieties who are looking for a fun event. Now, tell us a little bit about the event that you are here to talk about today. Well, we're here to talk about our 61st annual circus here at the Dane County Coliseum. Um, once again, as you stated, it's uh, family-based. We work with our producer, Mr. George Carden, to go around the country and around the world to get the best acts that he can find that promote good family relationships and are super a lot of fun. Very good. Lots of fun. Now, you've been doing this how many years, did you say? This is our 61st. 61st year. So right. this is something... We were actually putting circuses on before they built the Coliseum. Wow, okay. So we're the second longest running show at the Coliseum. That is very impressive. This is a well-oiled machine, I would have to imagine. Yes. And tell us a little bit about where the event is held. And now this is a mid-February event, correct? Correct. Okay. Uh, we hold it inside in the warm Coliseum. Mm -hmm. uh, so families can come in and all you gotta do is trek through the, depending on the weather, February is kinda, iffy every once in a while, but it's nice and toasty warm in there. Uh, there's a lot of noise and it's just a great time. The kids just love coming to the shows. Absolutely. What a fun, fun event to do. Highly recommend you check them out if you're looking for something fun that February 13th, 14th, and 15th. And 15th. Great. And just why a circus? What What is it about a circus? The family, uh, Shriners and the Masons are family based and what more, what better show to put on than the oldest entertainment in the United States is circuses, been going on for hundreds of years. And the, the like I say, the show is based all around, some towards the kids, there's some towards the adults, but most of it is the flash and the bang and you watch the kids and you see the tightrope walkers up there and they're going like that and the motorcycles and uh, we have horse acts this year which is new. We've brought back the Windy City, Windy City Tumblers, uh, which are a tumbling act, and they just blew our socks off the last two years, so we brought them back again this year to watch. The kids enjoy that. The whole thing is based on families. You can go down and ride ponies or camels or whatever. You can go down and get your picture taken with clowns. We have our own clowns plus the show clowns. Uh, and it's, like I said, it's all based right around the family unit. Very exciting. So this is a great kind of wow factor to see some really neat acrobatics of all kinds. Yes. And I imagine there are some trapeze work, you know, trapeze work going on. That yep. might be the right trapeze, term. Yep. Trapeze, yep. Uh, trapeze, uh, jugglers. We have uh, a teeterboard act where they go bounce and flip around like that. Um, yeah, then the, like I said, the high wire, of course, we have the tigers and um, the, the horses that I've already spiked. My favorite, which is unfortunately at the end of the show, is the human cannonball. Ah. David Smith is one of the premier cannonballers. Yes. In, in That's the, the grand in finale, the world. right? Yes, yeah. yeah. Uh, and, you know, he always puts on a good show. Um, like I say, we have lots of things going okay. on and it's constantly moving. There's very little drag time. So. Yeah, so it's an upbeat show, fun for the whole family, something for everyone, animal lovers, all the thrills, bells and whistles that you would hope right. for. Right. And uh, let's talk real quick before we go, I wanna mention now the prices are really very reasonable. So we're, we've got general admission for 17 and reserved seating for 21. So for, for a circus of this magnitude, what a great way, affordable way for family to get together and have right. a good time. Right. We, we strive real hard to put on a good show and keep the pricing down. Uh, we have, numer uh, of course, all the nobility buys tickets and stuff like that. Uh, we have some corporate sponsors. A couple other things that, that I'd like to add for the family thing is, with the purchase of a $2 program, mm -hmm. we're uh, through... Gener uh, generous donations from some of our units. We're giving away three bicycles wow. 
and three bike helmets at each one of the shows. Outstanding. We also have uh, family day passes to Circus World. Oh, fabulous. And uh, some passes for uh, Pizza Hut. Fantastic. In so addition to the tickets, and um, once again, thanks to generous donations, we bring in 29 special needs or underprivileged groups mm -hmm. for absolutely no cost. Wow. Uh, their Saturday morning show is based around those people. So, um, and any unused tickets from the nobility mm -hmm. are going to the military this year for families to oh, be wonderful. able to come to the show. Really great so. things that you're doing. So some wonderful giving back efforts as well. Great an event for families. Make sure you check them out on the 13th, 14th, and 15th. Please don't go anywhere. We've got more talk of the town coming up right after the break.